There is a new treatment option for men with stage 4 metastatic prostate cancer in Grand Rapids. We told you about the new high-tech U-Explorer full-body scanner being installed on the Medical Mile back in May. Now it's being put to use. News 8's Joe Lafergie has our story only at 6. It looks like something out of a sci-fi movie, but to Ron Foster, it's a chance at life. Gives me hope, and uh, this is sort of the last opportunity at this point in time. We're going to be getting started here. Just hold very still, please, okay? His doctor first noticed Foster's PSA level was high in 1994. It took 27 biopsies over several years to find the cancer. By then, it had spread to other parts of his body. At that time, we didn't have the technology that we have today. You feeling okay, Ron? He's been through a number of procedures over the years to keep the cancer in check. But the high-tech U-Explorer total body PET scan diagnosis and follow-up treatment in Germany has given Foster hope. Thanks to BAMF Health's new Grand Rapids Clinic, that same treatment approved by the FDA in March is now available in the U.S. We are cautiously and terribly optimistic about it. Two things set this scanner apart from others. The first is time. A normal scanner takes 20 to 45 minutes to complete a scan. This one produces images in about 10 minutes. And the images themselves give doctors a better idea what they're dealing with. U Explorer is a first of its kind medical 3D scanner that captures the patient's entire body in one position. It identifies only those cells that have the target we're going after. And then the therapy only targets those cells with the specific protein on its surface. What we know is that because of the precision of the treatment, kind of treating the cell from the inside out, there's absolutely less collateral damage, less uh, impact to the normal surrounding tissues. According to the American Cancer Society, one in eight men will be diagnosed with prostate cancer, most of them over the age of 65. Prostate cancer is the second leading cause of cancer death among men behind lung cancer. For men like Ron Foster dealing with stage four prostate cancer, the treatment is providing hope. You're keeping me alive with it, and we're terribly thankful. In Grand Rapids, Joe Lafergie, News 8.